Yes, we can finally start. Welcome, Ike. Uh, thank you. Awful Ike. I'm glad to be here. Oh my fucking god. Should I say talented Ike? Welcome back, man. How are you? Yeah, I can hear sheep in the background of your. <laughs> hold, hold on, I'll be, I'll be great. <laughs> no, good start. <laughs> I, have, I have a massive growling cat, right? Oh, uh, that's what that is. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Mr. Sheep. I'm just going to go yeah. open my fucking door. It immediately threw me off. I'm not going to lie. I thought those were really worst sheep. He lives <laughs> in a barn. He has his computer set up in the haystack. I don't uh, know if I should say something. Do, it, do, do be chilling in the barn. Welcome to the New Grounds Podcast. Today's episode hosted by... Bull Boy. This cat sounds like a dying old man, but I assure you he's adorable. That's okay. He's part of the show. Glad to have you today. Welcome, welcome. He's yeah. a guest as well. How was your airport trip? Did you make it safely? Did oh, it God, how do you know? Uh, uh, <laughs> so someone, the, the person you were driving spilled the beans in chat. <laughs> I also oh, nice. may have told told everybody in every little detail. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I went to go visit some friends in the city for like a week. I'm, I'm just now on yes, my computer. Yes, that's up awesome. Chrome, oh. Like a billion tabs. What city, if Hell you don't yeah. mind me doxing you and asking? Uh, Kansas City. Listen, Kansas my, city. Uh, all my stuff is still in my car. If you want to like throw a big rock through my window, you can have all of it. Cool. Oh, excellent. All your nice. expensive equipment. Yeah. I'm a little uh, broker. I'll be for no particular reason. <laughs> wow. Oh, wait, is that suspicious? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was just joking. I was just joking. I'm well, glad yeah. to have you, Mr. Winner. And uh, aside from the airport trip, how was your day today? I know that's a oh, it's going great. Fun question. Had a, had that's a, good. Had a great day. Had cool. a big fat burrito. Ooh. Oh, doing well. I had one last night. Oh my god, I had a shrimp burrito. <laughs> shrimp oh, burrito. Shit. I've never heard of a shrimp burrito. That sounds really good, but I don't like shrimp, so I'm gonna just take your word for it. Oh, it's good. Man. I relate it's with good. you. <laughs> Got it. Take All right. Minutes. So let, let's, I guess, start start the interview. So so Ike. So we're gonna sure. ask you the the. The most bare basic questions. So, alrighty. What? So, starting off, so just like get a little bit to know, a uh, little bit bleh, get to know you a little bit. So, what the what got you on Newgrounds? Uh, I've been interested in like flash games since I was like a small, tiny toddler. Uh, your parents just like throw you out of like a computer and like <laughs> hang out playing games, right? Yeah. Mm. But um, there would always be like the. Newgrounds tank guy at the beginning of all the cartoons and right. animation. Are you in your twenties? Uh, yeah, I'm in it, college. I'm like twenty-two. Okay, cool. That's a relevant question. Trust me. It's a. I mean, I mean, like you know, people will say like, oh yeah, I found the tank guy flash games. That'll be like sixteen. Sure. So, <laughs> like armored games, all <laughs> yeah. that stuff. Oh, that's cool. And, uh, <laughs> just made an account recently because uh, a bunch of friends encouraged me to. Yeah. What took you so long? Yeah. Uh, I don't, I don't know, man. <laughs> yeah. Can't answer that one. No, you basically, you, okay, so you showed up, and then you beat the shit out of everyone in this. No, s- no, don't say it like that. Please. <laughs> <laughs> you completely stomped out the rest of the competition with your big I, I, meaty I, I just posted skills. Funny little artwork. Oh yeah, you did such a good. Dude, you're job. amazing. And uh, you amazing, now man. are uh, super popular amongst Newgrounds, and then you yeah, also what? You're super rich too. Ooh, that's yeah, right. dude, you all that money. Stone. Yeah, that's amazing. That's a really great way to start, man. Good for you. I'm uh, not in it for the money. I'm in it for the Twitter likes, please. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's like a form of currency. You need the Twitter hearts, please. <laughs> yeah. So what did well, uh? Oh, go ahead, bull. Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, you're good. You're good. Uh, what? So when did you uh start animating? Uh, I, I I've been getting into it pretty recently. Uh. Wait, what? A, no, no, no. I mean, like, are you guys familiar with Pivot? Yeah, of course. That's what I grew up with. I think so. Is that the, like the, the... Like stick pivot. It's like stick yeah. figures and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. right. Yeah, yeah. That's how I like, got my start, too. Like stickpage.com, the program, yeah. dude. Yeah, stick page. And then I moved so to where Flash, all the, and then like, I got stick new figure game. fights come from? Yeah. I don't know if you've ever seen, like, uh, like, I feel like um, a lot of people... 
early on like Newgrounds, it's either flash or stick pivot and mm -hmm. uh people would do like pixel sprite animations and stick pivot there's a lot you could do with it it's actually pretty versatile for being a yeah. dinky little what i it's probably like a key logging virus on your computer but it's, oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So. <laughs> Uh, flash cost program. money at the time, uh, and I yeah. didn't know how to pirate things. Yeah, <laughs> it's okay. I still sorry. I, I buy things legally. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and so, uh, you you were using Stick Pivot for a while. Did you ever? I mean, you use Flash now, right? I use Toon Boom now. Uh, use Toon Boom. Uh, uh, big, big boy tools. Uh, Did you just jump no, no, yeah. right to it? Uh, I, I used Flash for a while. I, w I wasn't a huge fan of the brushes, right? Oh, yeah. That's fair. And then and Toon Boom is very... Uh, it's, it's okay. Yeah, Flash sucks ass. I love it. Yeah. Um, but only yeah, because it, it's like um, Stockholm Syndrome. What would you use now? Toon Boom. Toon Boom. Yeah, Toon Boom. Wait, no, I think I've and seen you animate sometimes. before. I watched you animate uh, oh. one time. I don't remember, but... Do you use a... Uh, you use like a brush on the on another layer and and color in a different layer, right? Because oh yeah, I I hate my life, right? Yeah, <laughs> it's fucking uh, that's fucking awful, <laughs> dude. I, I do just the, like the, I brush, do the same man. thing. <laughs> it's suffering. Wait. No, because with the normal brush, which is shit, you can use like a uh, fill everything uncolored, right? But with a uh, using brushes that are fancy and doing boom you have it, it it doesn't work the same way because there's a tiny gap that's transparent uh right next to your lines and doesn't fill properly so you have to like oh uh, that's awful oh uh, what i thought heck? see yeah. i thought you used uh am i wrong i don't know <laughs> oh sorry <All> right. Right. <laughs> <Go> ahead, <Bull. laughs> i was just like, I so many people so i don't know <laughs> I, I know. I thought you were uh, a uh, a grease pencil because uh, you're the way you like draw your lines. Remind I don't know why it, it reminds me a lot. Of, like I don't know if you watch Worthy Kids at all, but yeah, it, and mm -hmm. he, it reminds me a lot of his like his line work. And I know he's you a, big a lot of grease 3D pencil. in your stuff too, don't you? Yeah. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. I use a uh, uh, like God forbid I, I use Maya, right? Oh, Maya. you hate yourself! Oh, wow, that's gonna get me killed. Um, yeah, Blender <laughs> users are furious. Yeah, they're they're angry people. Um, <laughs> but uh. Yeah, I, I think I'd like to start using Blender. I like the grease pencil stuff, and uh, Maya has a serious lack of like tutorials online. Yeah, uh, they they expect it all to be like taught to you, which is very difficult as a sort of self self taught artist. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't I... help that the program breaks like doing the most simplest things. Yeah. Oh yeah, that. it's great, man. I know Potato Man uses it now, and uh, he praises it a lot too. Uh, he, he taught me a lot of what I know. Did he? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. he taught uh, Doggle too, my buddy. He's cool, and watching his process too is so much fun. He's fucking talented. Mm -hmm. He's very open to help. <clears throat> yeah, he is. Um, I wanted to ask too if you were. Uh, did you? I don't know if you already said. Did you? Where are you in school at all? Oh uh, yeah, I'm going. I'm doing an animation course right now. Uh, okay. Pretty early. Where do you go to school? It. Uh, in Missouri Western State University, dude. Oh wait, really? My I have yes. a friend who goes there. That's crazy. Yo, dox him. Give me his address, his name, his number. <laughs> I honestly, I'll give you. I think he also is in the same program. Oh, I may have met him. Uh, Seems you're like... already best friends. You don't even know. Yeah, we're, <laughs> yeah, we're already hanging out, dude. Without you, dude. That'd be really funny. <laughs> They're talking shit about you, dude. Uh, even I've heard yeah. about him. <laughs> oh shit! Everyone dude. knows about Dayton. That's right. Man, my fucking animation course fucking sucked ass. It was. I uh, go here because it's cheap, by the way. And so oh, well. you you went to school, and then from school you just topped on Newgrounds and showed the world how fucking talented you are. Uh, uh I, I I uploaded things, yeah. No, oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you just did a really good job. Like, uh, I'm, not, I'm not claiming anything. No, get me wrong. There's a lot of talented people on Newgrounds, but you. Your stuff's a whole lot of fun to watch. Um, I was going to ask, out of the whole jam, what uh, what was your favorite submission that you worked on? Or, like, your favorite out of all of them, I should say. Or maybe all of your submissions, just in general, Newgrounds. Uh, I think the easiest to create, uh, given the prompt, was the uh, the Orville one, where you're yeah. working at a little fast food place. Uh, yeah, that one was cool. 
I don't know. I, I think I want to expand that little world he lives yeah. in. Yeah. <laughs> yes, do it. Characters. Yeah, absolutely. I really yeah, like, absolutely should. I really like those good old Golden Wonder Days that you did too. That was a lot of fun. Oh my god, I love that. I, I, I love, love that one. Yeah. That was the that was the first thing I saw from you, and I was really excited. Dude, you could totally <laughs> use Orville as like a, a thesis. Do you have a thesis program in your in your course? Like, do you have to make a thesis by the end of it? Uh, I, I think we do. Oh, there you I, go. I should know, but you know. There you go. You can you can start with that. That's the, I I think <laughs> maybe I thesis know. is the best way to fucking because you're given all the supplies already so all you and and you you have to do it you're like obligated to to set your time to it so that you you, you can uh convince your professors you're like this is the fucking idea i want to do i'm not gonna fucking do anything else oh yeah i already have like my my, my pilot for my idea oh Ooh, all right what's what's the he, he stole a little bit of beans well. give, give us a little expand bit of jaw drops <laughs> Uh, no, 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 no ideas, because I'm subject to change, and then I won't do it. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's respectful. I always, I, I can't leak my ideas to people, because I, I, I get the satisfaction, and then I won't do it anymore. Oh, God, yeah, that's true, that's true. You, yeah, you uh, the momentum goes away, you're like, oh, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, and then they're like, yeah, okay, cool, and you're like, ah. Oh. They're like, yes, they thought it was cool, and then they're like, all right, and then you go yeah. sit down, and you eat a bowl of ice cream and you yeah, the magic's gone. Oh, yeah. You forget about I, it. I, I, I get that. Except I always do it. <laughs> and I screw myself over. You have good discipline. That's good. Uh, I, I could just like tell everyone all my ideas and not like uh, not make anything, you know? Yeah. That'd be cool. Dude, then everyone, you could be easily. the idea guy. Everyone wants to be the idea. Everyone loves the idea guy. Oh, yeah. I should know. <laughs> I went to school with a lot of them. Uh, Aside from being Idea Man and an amazing animator and artist, which uh, you also do really good art, um, I also know you do some music, right? Don't you dabble a little bit? I, 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 I do some. Yeah. Um, I, I want to upload more, though. What kind of music do you listen to? I know that's a really like that normal question, not an interview. I'm just actually genuinely curious. Sure. Um uh, I, I used to listen to like a lot more when I was in college because they have those like disgusting studio classes, right? Yeah. You you sit on like a wooden horse and just like draw for like three hours, right? Yeah. So so I would listen to, like a billion albums, right? And right now I'm really big on like goth rock. <laughs> goth. Oh, okay. Wow. Like a uh, Bauhaus and uh, uh, I I think they're called red red lorry, yellow lorry. They're cool. Yeah. <laughs> but um, that. Yeah. yeah, that's a that's a that's a unique answer. I noticed wow. you uh you also play some instruments. Like, so, uh, tell us a little bit about that. Oh God, um, I, I think I'm an addict, right? Yeah. <laughs> what do I you have, mean? Uh, like crack? Like, no, of course. Yeah, for my chair, I have like two guitars. I uh, I have an an accordion, right? From yeah. like the seventies. That's a disgusting rotting case. Uh, I had a piano in my room, right? Yeah. Uh, and it used to like uh, give me so so much like anxiety because uh, getting it into my little room was uh, horrible, but getting it out was going to be like impossible. Right. Um. And it was only like fifty dollars, and so me and my friends like put it in a truck and brought it over. That's cool. And then uh, I went to college and left it in my room, and my dad uh, absolutely like could not get it out. Yeah. Uh, so he would message me like every single day. And then he just like messaged me a picture one day of it just like destroyed on the lawn. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, holy shit! He, he's he's like fifty. Yeah. I don't know how he tore a piano <laughs> apart. Wow. But I'm glad he got it out of his hair. Yeah. <laughs> wow. the, so are you? Do you play the uh, the accordion? Uh, I I I dabble in it. Dab, dab, uh, you dabble in a lot of instruments. Are you like yeah, self taught? Yeah. Uh yeah um. I, I think I'm the best at guitar, and I can just I can just manage everything else. But you you self taught yourself the guitar and everything, huh? Wow, you're uh, sorta. I mean, the, the internet's a pretty good pretty good right, yeah, tool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course. Huh. Great. Uh, do, do you like doing music more? Or do you like doing art and animation more? Uh, I think music's more of a side thing, and uh, yeah, or art's really my main my main squeeze, right? Yeah. Uh, I, I think uh, music is what inspires most of my art, though, if that makes sense. Right. Like, I like making things that sound like uh, sound like songs. Or, sorry, they look like they sound like songs, if that makes sense. Yeah. 
I like the huh. feeling songs give me. That's fine. Awesome. I've never, I've never been good at doing music, and uh, which is, I, I ironically think it's tedious to learn music. Though I do animation, which is probably the most tedious thing next to like, I feel <laughs> more so would be like programming. Right? Yeah, no nah, programming. <laughs> programming isn't isn't too bad. Programming is disgusting. <laughs> no, nah, I don't. Know. Maybe I'm maybe I'm a crazy person. I, I I just I like I like programming. I don't oh my think it's gosh. it's only tedious when you don't know what you're doing. Once you know what you're doing, letters. then it's just it's yeah. you want to rip your hair out because you're like this sucks. I, it's it's well I guess I don't know I I've never known what I'm doing but trying to learn and trying to adapt to it it's awful I fucking hate it. Is I will never make games I and or do any programming and I've come to terms with that. I will animate. That's fine. I can really? at least sit there and it's not hard to use a paint bucket on like a bunch of, you know, <laughs> things that you drew. I press right? the button, it feels. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm becoming yeah, makes me see. <laughs> oh, cool. I lock up like a corpse. Uh, other thing, I want to go back a little bit to the to the three D thing. So I know it's just like like all, as well as just using three D a lot, like. Um, I noticed you use it specifically as like as like a backdrop um, for your animations. Now, was that oh, like oh, a yeah. was that like a stylistic choice or was that like workflow related? Uh, I, I think it's a little bit of both. Like, um, do you remember those like CN CD bumpers? Yeah, where they just had like a uh, Cartoon Network characters hanging yeah. out in, like real. Stuff? Yeah, That's so cool. I love that shit. Yeah, uh, of course. It, it was a little bit of that, and also like uh, like Orville had like two sets and then like oh. a billion shots. So just like changing between them with just moving a camera was nice and just changing the lighting a bit. That's cool. Oh man, that's a lot of fun. You're probably my age. I'm gonna guess. Uh, are, you, are you trying to hook up? Fuck no, no. Oh, you can't no, do that. No. Hold on, there's some. <laughs> <laughs> Why does everyone think I'm always constantly trying to have sex with the people that I talk to on this show? You're just like. You know, you're probably my age, you know? <laughs> no, it's just a fun fun thing that I like to do. I like to guess it. You said they 22, rubbing huh? his hand, biting his stuff. Like, ah. <laughs> Trying to locate me so he can steal all the shit in my trunk right now. Yeah, Kansas, It's out there, right? dude. <laughs> I'm already looking. I'm actually on foot as we speak. Well, what is the really one that's like, I know exactly what's going Triangulating my location, to. right? <laughs> locating. We just yeah, and your jack fingers. of all trades. How could I not act this way? So, like, yeah. uh, Cartoon Network wise, like, um, artistically, what would you say some of your like, like, what's your biggest influences when it comes to your art style and how you uh, approach animation? Oh, oh god, um, I don't know, maybe, maybe a little bit of Ed and Eddie with that line boiling, right? Uh, you can't, yeah. you can't forget the line boil. It's fun. It makes everything seem. Uh, it, it, it's like cheating, right? It, it just makes everything seem like it has a little bit more movement. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I, I think on the Newground side of inspiration, uh, I, I think like Bassett Films is a big one with this 2D stuff. Yeah. Yeah. What are some uh, of your other Newgrounds inspirations? Oh, geez. I'm not sure. I, I follow oh, so many people. <laughs> yeah. Do you? Like, what are some of your favorite people on Newgrounds? Uh, um, 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 hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> yep. Uh, this, guy, this indie artist named Tom Fulp. Oh, okay. That oh, fuck that guy. That guy. Okay. Um, all my friends who also make art as well. Aww. They're cool. That's cute. Shout them out. Who are they? Shout all of them. Um, we got. Hold on. Hold on. Pulling up Marshall? the list. Uh, Marshall. Uh, uh. You can hear my big clacky keyboard. Hold on. Yeah. Boner boy eight two four. I see him in here. Oh, of course, boy. yeah. Shout out to Boner Boy. <laughs> Shout out to Boner Boy eight two four. With the scout profile picture, he has the soda. <laughs> what is the soda oh, called? God. TF two. Bonk. Dude, bonk, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you even a real <laughs> gamer? No, I did not play that much TF two. Oh, that's fair. I TF two. I played my... Gary's mod. That's close. Close enough. Yeah, and CSGO. <clears throat> All right, well, we lost me there. I don't know. I don't know about that one. It's fun. <laughs> or right, Counter Strike Source then CS Go CS and oh, okay. Yeah. All right, you had you, you you brought me back CS Source. Yeah. Everything Source in general. Yeah. Mwah. Beautiful. 
Um, are you are you looking up the artists? Oh yeah, hold on. Oh no, I wasn't sure. Uh, I was just curious. I wasn't sure if you're ready for another question. I didn't know if you're ready for me to read them off. Ooh, no, I'm ready. Oh, we, we got everyone who, who who helped me work on my cartoons, right? Huh? Yeah. Ooh, we got yep. Eel Socks, Grease Brain, Let's go. Okay. Rose the Vixen, Sardinky, Falbun. Yeah. That's the, fun. The whole cast and crew. The whole cast awesome and crew. People. And then, so what do you, do you have any, like, uh, like major, like, some of the titans, you know? Everyone likes the, what are some of the guys? Uh, oh, like the, the, the Oni Psychic and Psychic Pebbles right? and shit, yeah. Uh, I think I was like raised on that stuff for better yeah. or for worse. Yeah, okay. I'm the same way. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't get <laughs> into the grounds until I. Yeah, I found. Uh, how did I find it? Oh yeah, I watched Sandy not included, but I found Lyle, and then I found out about Corey, and then I found out about Zach, and then it was just the rest is history. And I just was really? like, I found all of them. Yeah. Oh, of that's course. a weird way to get into it. I was I was following Eager Raptor when I was younger, and uh, that's what led me into uh, that and. Yeah, Eager Raptor, and then he did the Star Wars thing with, like, I think Oni. No, I think before that, I figured out. Because he did Leon Satan and shit earlier. Really. It mm -hmm. doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. But, um, yeah. Yeah, they're all huge inspirations. If you could collaborate with any Newgrounds individual, uh, who would you collaborate with? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I have no idea. Like, XX Squidward XX? Or... <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Yeah, totally. <laughs> I, I could provide some very good background music. <laughs> uh, I'm not really sure, actually. Um, I don't want to say anyone and have them watch this and be like, "What the fuck?" You, you, no, no, no. It's okay. We won't tell anyone. Uh, I, I think uh, Bassett Films is neat. I said him. Uh, do you guys know Doggy Bag? He's cool. Doggy Bag. That that sounds very familiar. Hold on. Let me. Do it does sound familiar. Fuck. Now I feel like a scumbag because I'm probably going to be like, oh, once I look it up. I'm not going to look it up, though. I'm going <laughs> to find out afterwards. You got to stay neutral as a, as a, um, as a exactly. journalist. Exactly. Yeah. Journalist. Don't call us. Yeah, this is journalism. <laughs> is it? Oh, it's no. Not not journalism. Journalism. Well, That's <laughs> well That's I, I guess I... Interview. Great interview, guys. Thanks for coming down tonight. I'm going to uh, go think about my life choices. You guys do have a Pulitzer Prize, right? <laughs> yeah, it's because it's the tanky. Is that, is that still giving uh, out? Thanks a lot for having me come here, boy. <laughs> uh, uh, but, uh, but in terms of artistic, I wanted to, like, uh, your actual just, like, art style. Like, how did sure. that come to be? Because it's very, like... I don't know even it's just real unique. I haven't seen anything like that before. Uh sorry, sorry I was laughing at just seeing kill yourself in the chat. That was, <laughs> <laughs> that was Teddy. <laughs> nice. Um, <laughs> uh, how'd I get my art style? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I, I really have no idea. Um I, I remember like four years ago it was like something completely different and I guess it just changes over time. Yeah. Uh I don't know. You just grab little little traits you like. I like thick black lines. Sometimes no lines. I like a lot of painterly stuff. Right. And, and when it comes know. to color selection, I notice you have a lot of like desaturated blues and reds. Is that like? Yes. Paint? It's so cool. Oh, I love that shit. Right. Yeah. yeah. I, I based my entire art style off TF2. That's right. Really? No, <laughs> For really? No, it's a joke. That's a lie. No, yeah, it took no, me a second. It may it's be like the partly, most saturated it, it, game. It, what? It, it might be a little bit of inspiration. <laughs> yeah. TFT's awesome. Really? Yeah, it is awesome. It is a pretty sick game. Well, <laughs> yeah. shut up, Shao. You don't get to. You say you no, don't I'm, play. I'm literally going to play it tonight. So you I have plans you to better. play it tonight. I'll, I'll play it with you. <laughs> no, don't play it tonight. It's broken. Stop. It's broken? it's broken? What do you mean it's broken? Uh, I don't know if this is off topic, but uh, it, yeah, it's a lot fine. of people just like join servers with like lag bots and like lag the servers. It's fucking yeah, it's awesome. Full of bots. Oh, it's full of bots. Oh, oh my god. People... Whatever. Well, last time we played it, we were playing um, where you're the pyro and you hit the ball back and forth, the bomb. Wait, what? It's like a tennis. Yeah. We, me and Dog will play. We just play the custom game. It's awesome. <laughs> yeah, they're fun. There's a lot of great. Uh, I should stop talking about this. <laughs> no, it's fine. That's the whole dodgeball. That's what it's called. I call it tennis. Yeah, Brandy played with us too. Sorry. <clears throat> um, but yeah, uh, I like your art style a whole lot. You, it's really cool. Thank you. 
Um, you're really awesome. Yeah, and, it is a um, gorgeous art style, dude. Thank you. I, oh, well, thank you. I want to know where. So now that you're part of the Newgrounds family here officially. Sure. Um, right? You'd say so, yeah? Yeah, sure. Okay, good. Because uh, we all agree here that you're made for Newgrounds and uh, you're here forever. So wh- like what do you. Th- what yeah, do there's you plan- no turning back now. There's none. No turning back. What do you plan on contributing to Newgrounds next? And how uh, long? Maybe new Orville episode. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ooh, ooh. That's that, that was a yeah, sir. Sure. You do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Yeah. Can't talk about it. Can't talk about it. Uh, no, no pictures. Um, I don't know. Um, more animations probably. More drawings. Yeah. Oh, that reminds me. Maybe some music in the future. Ooh, yes. Maybe please. Some, please, please more. Ever music. think about partaking in some of those awesome collaborations everyone's doing nowadays? Uh, of course, yeah. if they will have me. Of course, I'm sure people will. Sure that, yeah, you just gotta slap that. Uh, I mean, you now have the the official title of the the summer animation jams winner, like on like that's that stays with you forever. All you have to do is say, "Hey, I won the summer animation jams," and people are just gonna drop their pants for you. No, I, I'm not gonna like stop wearing the t-shirt when it gets here. I'm gonna walk into like Starbucks and get free shit, right? Fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> like, do you know I'm Newgrounds famous? And they're gonna be like, oh my, oh, I should have known. I'm so sorry. Sure, this way. And they're gonna pull out the yeah. back of the red tape. And it, gonna... <laughs> it works every time, let me say. Oh, on on like God. the government list, it's higher than a <laughs> than a veteran's discount. It's, it's up there. <laughs> it's, 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 ten, it's 11%. Uh, yeah, I served in the summer jam. Step aside, please. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a bit i guess this is technically a little bit of confidential information but uh brandy had informed me that you were originally working on a uh, submission for round five um and I, I guess like school got caught up do you do you ever plan on uh like releasing that uh it, it, it's an idea that i that i had um I, I, i'm not sure i think i'll work on some other stuff maybe before then all right yeah. fair. you want to you want to hear about it maybe yes yeah, yeah. I had like a whole like script written out. I'm not, I'm not sure if this is interesting to to tell over over the air. You know, this is broadcast, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, dude, spill the beans. So actually, five hundred people right now. What? Yeah. Um. Yeah, if you multiply twenty by like a couple. I'm numbers, feeling the pressure now. <laughs> Where are you? But uh, yeah, I I wanted to do something that uh wasn't like a trailer per se, but was like a parody of trailers. Yeah. I wanted to feature like a something cheesy and dramatic, and then he he, he somehow notices a door to like the, like another trailer, and he just like shifts through reality a bit, like he's in an action movie, then like a horror film. Yeah. And then he somehow like falls out of the letterbox, the like black lines on the top and bottom, and he's just in like a warehouse of like, wait, what the fuck is that? Hold on. He says that. Sorry. That sounds awesome. So I saw the edit in the chat. Oh. But um, cool. yeah, and he's just in like a little warehouse, and then he gets shut, like locked in. Yeah, this is very interesting. Why am I saying this? You're fine. You're totally <laughs> fine. <laughs> You're fine. It's cool. I'm 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 on the edge of my seat. Keep going. Uh, and then I just I I wanted to end it with something something grim. You don't have a punchline. Uh, I I wanted the opposite of a punchline. I wanted like a like a punch in the gut, basically, right? Okay. I wanted like a like like a voice talking to this little character who like stepped out of his little boundary, uh, t- t- wishing him a good time, and then like all the lights shut off, and then he's trapped there. It's, it's cool, cool stuff, man. Oh. oh. I wanted to specifically be not funny. I wanted to like hype up the funny, the not funny. Right, and then yeah, just demoralize Newgrounds. Then nothing. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. Do you so? Where would you place genre wise your content? Genre wise, genre wise. Like, how would you say the tone of your content is? What? Are you in a mall? Listen. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have, a, I have a clock that goes off every oh. hour. <laughs> is, that the, is, that the, is that the Angelus? Do you need to pray? No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's time for church, actually. It's prayer time. Oh, oh my gosh. Everyone you gotta get Jack back in here. Close your Get eyes, on let's your hold knees, hands. hands together. Oh, wait, we need Jack. Jack oh, Jack left. Shit. Mm-hmm, he did left. Fuck, we need Jack to lead the prayer. Fuck. We had a prayer earlier. We did. If you, have, we had a if you pray right too much, uh, it cancels out. So. 
Everyone send prayer emojis in chat, please. We, we need this, please. Please, everyone. I need your power. Guys, please pray for us. Please, 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 please. Everyone's distracted by Cam. He's ruining the entire fucking... <laughs> Why did that respond to <laughs> that comment? <laughs> 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 yeah, we're blessed, dude. The, this uh, this podcast is officially blessed. <laughs> Every, bless Sorry, what was the question again? <laughs> uh, my soul, my soul is getting saying, rejuvenated with these prayers. What emojis. genre? What genre would you place your content in, if you could give uh, it one? Christian. Christian. Uh, no, probably comedy. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, just, some jokes. Okay. Would you like dark comedy? Everyone likes to do dark, dark comedy. comedy. I don't know what that means lately, but it's the new. Thing. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't call it dark comedy. Dark uh, comedy. Dark. Um, edgy. Uh, it's usually comedy where they say uh, like a slur sometimes. Oh, school shooting <laughs> joke. <laughs> yes. Another NGP with the school shooting joke. We won't go there. Zin, <laughs> Zin explicitly said before this, don't go into school shooting. <laughs> what, what, what about my content? I feel up for school shootings. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> We didn't that's, know that's, it. Sin, we didn't <laughs> we didn't start that one. That's, that's the next Orville episode, actually. Oh gosh. Well, it's honestly if it's it's only fair, because Newgrounds in a way spawned from that era. And uh some of its Pico earliest school, content, dude. like Pico School, you know, it's uh and it was right around that time where, you know, that that, that started happening. Um, and, uh, I'm not going to keep talking about this. I'm going <laughs> to stop that before I get in trouble. Uh, so you have, uh, in turn, so I'm like, you did you, outside of like the last one, you did, you did do four animations. Do you have any interesting stories like, or any like interesting tidbits behind the scenes for any of those, your submissions? Uh, uh, maybe hold on. <laughs> Uh, I, I'm not really sure. Um, I, mean, I, I guess not. I'm not completely sure. Wow. Okay. All right. No, I'm just I'm kidding. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. Kidding. No, I'm no, sorry. you're totally fine. I'm sorry. <laughs> Listen, uh, I don't know. All right. Well, think... how about this? Where, so in terms of – I'm going to ask you the, 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 the job interview question. Where do you see yourself in five years, or where would you like what to see What question is that? I don't know. Like, uh, <laughs> world domination, this, right? This, this podcast is my stepping stone. Yeah. It, it could be. It could be. Hitler too, but nicer. Uh, wait. If you could, if you could, wait. Hold on. Let me. That's a good, let me, that's to, a good idea, Vosh, for that dude. Uh, that's a to uh, jump off of this question just a little bit. Do you do you want to make a living off of making content for people? I actually uh, I hate the word content. Ideal, I'm right? going to retract that. Making um like what you love for other people if i ever say the word content again shoot me in the fucking head <laughs> <laughs> i'm sorry i, I, I think that'd that be the dream to be as independent as possible right right uh, okay cool may, may, maybe getting hired by a studio or something doing work for them that'd be nice. yeah do you want to try to thoughts and ideas somewhere oh sorry sorry what now Oh, I said, I said do, like, are you trying, do you want to, like, lead stuff? Do you have, like, any, like, show ideas you've, like, you want to, like, you know, get on the big screen? Uh, it, it'd be nice, you know? Yeah. But, uh, I, I, I've understood that that's kind of, like, a lottery situation. It, it very much is. It's all, it's all about who you know. Sure. And, uh, I don't know, uh, I, I think my most modest, uh, plan is to work for a studio, and it'd be cool. Yeah lead some things maybe in the future once i get some experience under my belt yeah you want to be a, like a like a 40 hour week wage slave i will uh lead lead disney i'll be disney ceo <laughs> be i cool. will buy everything <clears throat> so do you want to be rich uh yes actually um i'm the new billionaire actually like in like two yeah. years probably yeah well you just made a shit ton of money didn't you Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, and I uh, spent it on the trip I just went on. Yeah, we just spent it on. Oh, never mind. You just said <laughs> I literally Where'd have that as a question. Where'd you go? Uh, Kansas City with my friends. Uh, a a you, lot of my wait, I thought you lived in Kansas met up City. for like a week. What now? I thought you lived in Kansas City. Uh, I live near Kansas City. But, oh, uh, you live near I, Kansas City. Okay, but you went to Kansas. Okay. 
Gotcha. This is where a bunch of my friends met up from the internet. Oh, I see. Oh, that's fun. And so you made a shit ton of money, and you're like, it's on me, motherfuckers. And then you brought them all out, and you guys partied. No, absolutely not. I paid for myself, and everyone else oh. paid for themselves. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I split the, the money between everyone that helped me work on stuff. Oh, okay, cool. Well, yeah. They're all very cool people, by the way. You should check them out. Yeah. Hey, anyone in on particular Twitter, you want to shout out? Hmm? I said anyone in particular you want to shout out? Uh, can I like uh, do like a lightning round? Uh, yeah, sure. Can someone on in chat transcribe everything? Uh, epic, awesome. Uh, if you go to the the Orville animation, you can see uh, that that's like everyone that helped me work on stuff, right? Uh, I had uh, my friend Eel Socks do a bunch of like the animations, like animation like clean up, not clean up, but like help with stuff. Like uh. Uh, probably a few seconds each, but uh, for good old fashioned Golden Wonder Days, he did the the Tank Man animation at the beginning. I, I love Eel Socks. That guy's awesome. I guess. And uh, my my bud Grease Brain, he's in chat. He's in chat right there. S sound off, sound off, man. Um, Eesh. he he did a bunch of like background artwork and stuff. He's cool. <laughs> um, s some like logos here and there. Uh, Rose Devixen did sound design. She's neat. Yeah. Uh, Sardinki, he's a talented voice actor. Oh yeah. He's cool as well. Um, and Valbun did the music. And then where can everyone find you? Uh, I'm on Twitter and Newgrounds. Uh, on Newgrounds, I'm awful dash Ike, and on Twitter, I'm uh, yeah. awful underscore Ike. Aww. <clears throat> Check out my little drawings. They're, yeah. mo they're mostly trip pictures right now, but. And look forward to new animations. That's so exciting. Yeah. You had to post more yeah, art can... on uh, on Newgrounds. I didn't know you had so much art. I was looking through your Twitter Sorry. and I was like, Fuck. "Yeah, he does." Yeah, I, 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 I like your, I like your cartoons. I really do. But I could, I really like your art. I like sitting there, and I really was excited to, uh, to start following you and seeing more of that come out, because you have a really cool style. I know that's such a fucking. I hate that, like. Like, uh, what, what am I trying to say? I hate that compliment. Like, oh, your style is really... But you know what I mean. It's, yeah, it can't be helped. Sure. No, it's great. Yeah. A lot of people jump to colors. It is a good style. I it like the elasticity good, yeah. of it. It's like... I do too. This very elongated sort of... I don't know. It's so hard to describe styles because it's just like no, something uh, you interpret. Oh, totally. But No, you have uh, a really... Uh, I don't know. You have a really good way of... um adding detail to your animations and, and yeah. having it all uh how do you say like all the shapes are still intact and you have a really good sense of uh, like dimension to your animations like with the dancing one like it, it's really fucking awesome dude uh, i love your shit i like to keep my my my, my shapes seen they're very cool yeah, yeah, yeah. i'll take it... my word for it <laughs> oh i will <laughs> But yeah, it's fucking great. Oh, please. You've heard it here first. He's, he said it. No, that's right. Yeah. I, I'm cool. Follow me, please. If you're not please. following Ike already, then I'm going to hunt you down. Last so I checked, he had, until the end of this episode. And, he had 499 followers. I would like to see uh, almost... Uh, 450. I mean, wait. 450 actually, wait, no, wait. Go almost... so follow me right now. 450. Uh, plug the shirts. Uh, I'll get to that. I can't. I can't plug someone else's shit. <laughs> you guys can't follow this other guy. Uh, yeah. Listen, the shirts are cool. Very soft. I haven't got mine yet. Uh, fuck. You guys are so distracting. Cam's in the chat. Everyone's pinging me in the chat. <laughs> this, this does not happen on NGPR. <laughs> fuck you guys. Fuck Cam too. <laughs> Overall, what would you say, like, what are your, some of your, like, favorite cartoons? Like, unrelated to, like, Newgrounds. Just, like, quite literally anything. Dude, Ed and Eddie, dude. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's a classic, right? I love the creator of Ed and Eddie, too. He's amazing. <laughs> He's so cool. Didn't he and get, like, I love shot? all this stuff that doesn't get made. Something like that? This is, like, a Bill Primo shot. I don't know. Primo know Bill Primo... Like, Wait, by what? gun? I don't know. Bill Primo told me that someone who... Like, I thought he said it was the creator got, like... Ran from the cops uh, and got shot by the police. 
What? <laughs> what the fuck? Like 50 Cent? <laughs> Every time yeah. I bring up the career of Ed and Nettie, someone else has a fucking thing that they heard about him. Like, I know, like, he never... Uh, he, he made this show as a prank, which... Or, or like, a no, a, a dare, sorry. And then uh, he... What else? Oh, yeah, he, he never gave up the rights to Ed and Nettie, so he still has them. And he's all done. He's not going to sell them or anything, which is fucking based. That's awesome. And... Uh, I heard a whole bunch of other stuff, but yeah, he's a he's a lunatic. A lot of fucking show creators are, especially cartoons like uh, Groomer McGee, who's the guy who did um, who's the grooming guy who did? Uh, oh, that was, was um, Ren and Stimpy. Ren yeah. and Stimpy, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, him. Kind of, yeah, kind of disappeared because he's a Bad, yeah. fucking gross piece <laughs> yeah. of shit. Well, let's not talk yeah. about him because he doesn't deserve any <laughs> airtime. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Listen, all, all I have to say is if you want to see some cool animation, look up Brothers Gum. Brothers Gum. Yeah. That's the that's the Ed and Eddie's uh creator's uh previous work. Ah, cool. It's neat. Yeah. Isn't Very it gross. I also heard something No, I'm not gonna get into it. I was gonna say something <laughs> about the regular show creator thing. <clears throat> oh. They seem cool. They seem really cool. No, no, no JJ no, Quintel bad. is They're super cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's yeah, like yeah. my favorite guy. Is that, yeah, but they just have cool like backstory. Um, but I'm not gonna. I'll, we're gonna get into a rabbit hole. Um, Honestly, it's fine. Let's just let's just talk about you know. Let's talk about let's talk about stuff. You know. Yeah. So like, what what do you what is, what's been catching your attention lately? What's something you really like that you want <laughs> like want to tell people about? Oh my my attention. Yeah. yeah who are you? Uh, who am I? Um, I don't know. Um, yeah, I guess I didn't really come prepared for this question. <laughs> That's okay. I'm not sure how to yeah. pull that out of my head. You know, like a song, just like, you know, maybe like a piece of art, just something that you're like thinking about that you're like, man, that's fucking really cool. Any, any like obsessions lately? Um, Can we further uh, over- overstimulate you with questions right now? <laughs> um, maybe I could keep on the, the topic of overstimulating. Uh, um, a, a, a piece of art I've really enjoyed recently. Uh, that, that's very cool and awesome. H- have you guys seen the film Brain Dead? No, I have not. Wait, no, Isn't I have that definitely alive? seen it. But... Are, you, are you talking about that alive? The Peter Jackson movie? Yeah, it, it, it goes by both names. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, that's my favorite zombie movie, dude. I, I remember seeing it as a small child, and uh, <laughs> oh, I, I showed it to a bunch of my friends recently in a call, <laughs> and uh, everyone seemed to really uh. At first they hated it and then they really enjoyed it. I, I recommend showing all your friends yes. Brain Dead or Dead Alive what is it without called? any content. I vouch for that, dude. That is the best zombie Wait, movie Wait, say the name. What is it called? Brain Dead. It, it, Brain Dead? Brain Dead or Dead Alive. Or Dead Alive. Is it not in... What country is it? From? New Zealand, it's Dead Alive, I think. Right? Ah. It, it's like Peter Jackson's second movie. It, yeah. It's like a billion gallons of... Yeah, gallons of blood. It's very creative and fun. That's it's cool. so fun. There, there's a, uh, there's a mo- if here's some incentive. Uh, there's a moment where two zombies, uh, they fuck and they make a baby, and the baby, <laughs> what? And the baby uh, wow. is evil. <laughs> and then the main it's character. Evil baby. It's an evil. It sounds like, like a, a really, really cheesy '70s movie. That's what that sounds it's like. Face into, it's yeah. it's a like horror it's a great movie. movie. Which it, I love. It's horrible, 70s. but it's also the best thing ever. Yeah. It is the best thing ever. Nah, I wouldn't say it's horrible. I, I don't know. I vouch for it. <laughs> I fucking love that movie. Are you Especially... a horror movie fan? I... Oh, I love horror movies. Um, I love that, like, yeah. pulp 70s yeah. just bullshit. Oh, so it is like a 70s sort of cheesy horror movie. Uh, it's in, it's oh, no, it came in out like the 90s. 90s. Yeah. 90s. Oh, okay. But it, well, it's but a it's homage very reminiscent to that shit. Old. What's your mm-hmm. thoughts yeah. on Grindhouse? I love Grindhouse. Yeah, that's, that's the very uh yeah that's the 70s uh, that's all that 70s 80s kind of shit right? oh no it's spe- I'm, uh-huh. I'm, i mean speci- i'm like specifically talking about the the tarantino oh the tarantino oh yeah 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 Is that I, I i saw a scene from it recently because uh one of my friends was like pinging me off the off the hook to like join the voice chat right mm-hmm. and then i did and he was just watching the, the the scene from death proof where the the car crashes yeah like on loop and like cackling <laughs> and then that's what i've seen of death oh. proof but uh what was it planet terror planet, planet terror is pretty cool yeah i feel like you, you you might enjoy planet terror it's got a bit of that it's kind of silly and it's got a, like a big 70s vibe to it i haven't seen that either it's really funny um. like i would I mean, not to spoil anything because this is like a huge plot point but there's a one point where one of the main characters okay. she takes her son like 
uh, she's going to like I guess kill the father or something, and yeah. she like ha- he's in the car. She hands him a gun. She's like, "Okay, Tommy." He's like, "If anyone comes to the car, like you shoot them, okay?" You, and like he's like, "Oh, including dad." He's like, "Especially if it's your dad, okay?" He's like, "Be careful." And she closes the door. And she walks out, and immediately the gun goes off, and she runs <laughs> back, and he shot himself in the face by accident. <laughs> oh man, fucking awesome! <laughs> Lady with a gun leg, dude. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, the, the gun leg. <laughs> uh, the whole the whole movie is just it's it doesn't take itself seriously at all but it's so it's yeah. super entertaining there's a movie in that sort of genre called uh psychomania that sounds familiar actually it, it's about a bunch of bikers like british dudes who uh they they believe that uh they'll like come back whenever they like like die so they they just like become immortal yeah it's like nonsense, but it has a really cool like that, that sounds prog amazing. 70s soundtrack. That sounds oh. amazing. They have like skulls on their helmets. It's awesome. That that sounds, but I guess not because I haven't seen it. But that's cool. Oh my god! I'm reading the Wikipedia. And yeah. It said, uh, so it was created by George Sanders, and it said he committed suicide after making the film. It, it's it's just oh, a nonsense. Whoa, holy movie. shit! No, he believed he would become <laughs> immortal, dude. Whoa! Ah, uh, you he know his yeah, little motorcycle. Makes... He he, he fell in love with this movie contract? too much. God damn. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll look into that. That sounds the fun as fuck. He bought to, it. Yeah, he bought stem it. Stem off of the uh, the movie talk. I wanted to ask you too. You said you like TF2. What other sort of like uh, games did you grow up with? Um, I don't know. Um, ever heard of Fur Fighters Two, dude? <laughs> No, Uh-oh. you grew up Uh-oh. with that. Uh oh. That... No, nobody's heard of this fucking game, right? <laughs> Fur Fighters. What is that for? No, no, no. You're getting the wrong idea. Hold on. Fur fighter? Yeah, you know exactly what I'm thinking. Of. Hold on. No, you're just little animals with guns going around shooting things. That's a I, I think I haven't even gotten past game? the first level when I was younger. Oh, it's a PlayStation 2 game. Mm-hmm. It's also on the Dreamcast. Whoa. Yeah, it looks very Dreamcast. I feel like I've seen a screenshot of this before. <laughs> uh, hold on. Let me post the... Like, the um, like a like cover yeah. art. <laughs> and so that's what you grew up with. And so, would you Bentley say that? Bentley and 64 stuff, all the basics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You play like Mario 64 and shit. Oh yeah, of course, man. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. I just fucking cut the podcast. It's just stupid. I just want to get to know Ike. <laughs> this is dumb. I remember tough. there was this racing game I had an N64. Yeah. Uh, and um. It, it would scare the fuck out of me, right? Because yeah. on the little selection screen where you're selecting the cars, it tells you like how hard they are to drive. <laughs> and then whenever you selected like the hardest to um, the hardest to drive car, it goes, "It's dangerous!" And it, that scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> I, I, w- I would like shut it, like unplug it, like yeah. just run out of the room. Did you ever get freaked <laughs> out by the uh, like the the like the PS2 like? I don't know, like every game console's error, their errors thing, or like it would turn red. And yes, like, of course. It's like you open up a portal into another dimension. <laughs> like, it, like, like you see the the like neurons that are like firing off in this little like machine, right? It's terrifying. You were meant to see that. I used to run into the other room whenever I would get the red error disc in my PS2. I would scream and run in the other room, <laughs> and I would make my mom turn it off. Everyone talked about that shit, but I always thought it was cool. And then I liked that the towers, which I found out way later, all the towers represent when you start up your PS2, uh, all of your like playtime in different games or something like that. Depending on how tall they are, is like how much you put into the PS2. I swear to God, something like that. Like no, I the heard bios that too. collects that data. Really it's fucking awesome, yeah. Um, which I didn't like though is when the PS2 uh, would get mad at you for having a scratched disc, and then would go brown, and then it would get all red. Oh, yeah, God, that's why yeah. I had the post. Yeah, that's, that's, that's Oh, that's what you're talking. Oh, yeah, I yeah. about booting up the PS2. Oh no, no, that's what I was oh. talking. Specifically, the error thing. Yeah, the the red shit. That that, oh, okay. that would make. Yeah, me... that that was kind of yeah. That that one made me upset, like genuinely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my uh, <laughs> apparently very sad that... feeling. In the Xbox, the OG Xbox, if you left it on long enough, it would start playing like weird, like code, like Morse code, like number station shit. 
That's like, really scary. <laughs> they like intentionally just put really creepy shit that would like just if you left it on long enough, it would start playing. The Xbox used to scare the shit out of me just in general. It's just too much. The moment you turn it on, oh, it's like dude, boom, yeah. boom, 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 boom. It's like Jesus <laughs> fucking Christ. It's like right in your face. The controller is like meant to look like an alien ship. Yeah. <laughs> and and especially it had games like like uh, Oddworld and shit. So if I played Halo, it's like booting up demo disc. What the fuck? And it's all these weird like fusion frenzy, like Oddworld types of games. And it's like stuff that's really, it, it, I don't know who it's for. Like it's not for kids. This isn't for adults. It's just weird. So it seems like alien like, I don't know. It's very uh, overwhelming. <clears throat> Xbox was only fun for me for Halo. I'm not going to lie. Fusion right. frenzy is cool, but I mean, I, I had friendly? Mario Party. Yeah, I don't know if you were probably that. That was fun. Uh, do you guys remember uh, uh, the, the PS1 could play like a... Uh, oh, sorry, the PS2 could play PS1 games? Yeah. 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 Uh, that air screen was fucking terrifying. What is? I, I kept trying to play Search for Reptar and it kept fucking up. Wait. Also, that's another scary game. Why are all the games scary, dude? Yeah. <laughs> Search for Reptar? You go into the basement? Mr. Friends down there? Mr. Friends? I don't know yeah, Mr. what fucking games that you're playing when you're growing up. It seems like you're getting no. games out of the bargain bin, my friend. Yeah, bargain bin you... bullshit, right? <laughs> uh, Which I, I think I talked about this on NGPR, but one time when I was a kid, my mom uh, stopped at the game store for my brother, and I wanted a game, and I didn't think it was fair that he was getting a game. And she's like, I'll get you a game if it's under $5. I'm like, fuck it. I'll do it. And so and you're like, I looked yes. at the and yeah, I found like a $3 game. It was called Double, which um, people are actually familiar with nowadays somehow. But it's a game about a little alien that screws in screws, and that's it. And it's the stupidest fight. It's, it's called Double, and that's the worst sound effects ever, and it's really scary. <laughs> it is, I had a fucking blast. Though. I played the shit out of Double. I didn't care. It was a $3 game. <laughs> I remember being scared of video games when I was a kid. Just, like, normal yeah. stuff. Yeah. What scared you about them? Like, uh, what is it called? Like, Blockland? Do you remember that? Blockland. No, I know Cube no. World. Block it, it was like a <laughs> PC game that looked like Legos. But, um... Oh! Uh, yes, I do know this. It, it would, uh, take place in these, like, uh... The idea was that they were Legos, so it would be in, like, a giant kitchen or, like, a giant bedroom. But I, I would be, like, terrified because there was, like, the night version of each level. Holy and, uh, shit. Wait, hold on. I, I'm sorry. I just I, realized I was so the fuck scared someone was. would just, like, walk in and, like, kick me over or something. Like Whoa. A giant model. I remember when this and Roblox came out, like, they were, like, competing early, early, early back in the day. Mm-hmm. And they were both very Lego-like. And so I was in, interested in both of them. But then Blockland cost money, didn't it? Mm-hmm. The yeah. demo is free. Right, the demo is free. And so I'm like, man, I want to do that. And then Roblox came out. I'm like, man, I want to do that. But then I never played either of them because my computer couldn't handle it. And then Minecraft came out and it was all over. But oh, Yeah. Sorry, hold on. I know exactly what you're talking about. Blockland. Uh, the space is in the game. That's terrifying. Oh, that's sick. <laughs> that's so fucking scary. What is that's that? That's not on? okay. Is that an enemy? <laughs> No, no, you can just, like, uh, you can customize your character. Like, the game is just you build shit. That's it. Yeah. Oh. So you can just have that face on your character. That's fucking terrible. Yeah. I, I thought that was, like, something that flashed on the screen or something. That's a really yeah. nice face. Some, like, pet scotch. That's great. Shit. It's interesting, because those games competed, and that's probably why Roblox ended up becoming big, and that game didn't. Mm -hmm. I mean, holy I, shit. I think it's out for free now. Like a, yeah, like well, a fan, who uh, fucking cares it. about it? It's just it's crazy because Roblox was not that big. Like, I was a kid when that was... I mean, I was pretty much like uh, early teen or maybe 12, 13 when that came out. And uh, no one knew about fucking Roblox. And now it's like super popular, blown up. Like, every fucking kid plays it. And it's a big, like, pyramid scheme, which... Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Damn. I don't know how they got to that, but... Wow, it's an yeah. NFT. Yeah. The Roblox, <laughs> NFT Roblox is an NFT. Oh, well, it's already here, I'm sure. <laughs> Fucking talk about <laughs> NFTs, I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ike, do you play well, releasing any NFTs? <laughs> yeah, when's the awful Ike NFT? Oh, God, shut up. <laughs> I want the so, Orville sorry, what NFT, What does NFT bro. stand for? Uh, Non-fungible non token. Uh, Non-fuckable titties. Yeah. It's the idea of having oh, titties. Oh, yeah, I, I, am, I am releasing some. Oh, yes. 
Yeah, you know what? You, yeah. <laughs> I, I can see that, honestly. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> you, have, you have good art. You have good art. And I feel like good okay. artists sometimes, you know, want to make extra money off of them. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. I was talking about their definition. You oh, know, their definition. Okay. You know this fucking MS Paint headshots? Like... Wait, what did you what? say? Those oh, look you... like oh. NFTs. I, I was like, oh, I don't want to fucking do this anymore. <laughs> The, the only MS reason, Paint well, I mean, oh. I, and I'm not, I'm not gonna get into NFTs right now, but my biggest issue, my biggest issue, is just that the art sucks. I just wish it was at least good art, you know. Zach did something about the art, probably, NFTs right? They blow up you get that shit from Beeple. Yeah, Beeple's like the only fucking one that I feel like is making like art for like their NFTs. Everything else is like fucking pictures of. Like, it's all eight by eight men. shit that you can do and like. Yeah. It's because that's all. It's, it's hard all to fucking believe. Money laundering. All that stuff. Is yeah, money it's laundering. money laundering. You, you can tell. Yeah. It's so easy to tell. It's just like it's like it's literally no different than like if you go to like art galleries like with like the fine art paintings. That's just like a like a slap. Like someone like <laughs> their ass cheek on a canvas and like oh this is three million dollars. It's just like it's, <laughs> oh. it's money laundering. You know you know no one seriously think like actually yeah. thinks that it's like that it can afford it thinks it's worth that much but then they can buy it and then they get it praised and then they uh and they sell it even more and kids that's how uh, that's how the art world works at least in the high society oh art, art's fucking great I, I i went to a museum recently with friends uh in kansas city um and uh they have uh do, do you know the guy he just paints a like a he paints a canvas black i think so um and then that, that's what he that, does that's one guy I think it's one guy, right? I like uh, otherwise, uh, they have some explaining sure. to do. <laughs> I we, feel we like a lot just, of people like, could do it. Blank. Oh, really? How much do they um, sell for? Oh, I have no idea. They were in a museum. They were to watch. Oh, god at, damn. They probably um, sell for they, a lot. They, they reminds I, me I saw of a the... clip studio piece on the wall. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> it's like a prestigious... <laughs> Must have taken hours. Uh, yeah, like uh, they they put so many filters on that. I bet. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. It's uh, all of it. All. <laughs> oh man. I love. Art. Reminds me That's of the true. fucking banana. So you, you heard about yeah, the banana? Yeah, the banana. Oh, I love yeah, the banana. I actually, like I love it. that someone just ate it off the wall. <laughs> I <laughs> fucking grabbed it and ate piece. it all. Oh, yeah, you that's could just right. I forgot about that. Yeah, there, there's so no security around. It. You can go up and fuck with it, and they don't. Well, I mean, as long as you're not constantly doing it, but yeah, you can go up and fuck with it, and they don't care because they'll just they it's just put the another art. banana. <laughs> Didn't he say like that was the art? Apparently, the art was the banana getting eaten. Apparently, with that though, is as dumb as it is. The instructions for setting it up are like very, very specific. Like you have to like put the duct tape in this, and there has to be a fold right here. Like you basically every time they put it up, they make it re recreate it exactly. Maybe, maybe, that's, hold that's on. maybe really it's funny. metaphorical. Maybe that the people are the monkeys for taking the banana and not following instructions, therefore making they them monkeys. They, they couldn't like hold themselves. That's, they needed the banana. that's the art. Yeah, they can't hold themselves back from being monkeys and eating the banana. That reminds me of a. Do you know Bird in Flight? No. I think it's called Bird in Flight. Let me look it up real quick. Hold on. I'm gonna talk about false information here. Oh, false information. Welcome to uh, Jones Cast. Our new guest, <laughs> Alex Jones, is gonna come on in a few minutes. So you <laughs> the, the facts cast. Some pills. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm gonna is, run away for this a second. Too small. This we thing. Can fix this thing here. Oh, quill. Wait. Uh, that's that's bird in flight. It is a, a little sculpture. But it was uh, one of, one of the, like the early things to be like modern art, I guess. Uh, so whenever they uh, shipped it over from uh, from I think like England or something, they they marked it as art. But uh, the guy reviewing packages was like, no, no, this is a kitchen utensil. Uh, because art doesn't get taxed. Uh, so uh, yeah, that's the story of Burden Flight. Wait, oh wait, so oh so it was marked as a kitchen utensil or Sorry, like. I'm back. <clears throat> and because like the the shipping guy just didn't know what to make of it, so he's like, "Oh yeah, this is this is for the kitchen." <laughs> he just bought it. And he's like, "All right, cool." This is a nice man. No, no, it, it was the guy checking out like the boxes going through like uh, customs. Oh, oh, okay. I thought it was just like, all right, okay. This makes more sense now. Art makes no this sense. This is a podcast. I probably shouldn't talk about anything visual. 
<laughs> Look up Bird in Flight sculpture. There we go. Yeah. I sometimes forget that. <clears throat> All right. So yeah, you know, you know what? So we're gonna have, we'll do a couple more questions, and, I, and then I think we'll probably wrap it up because we're getting to the one hour mark, and I have to edit this in two days, so that's gonna be uh, oh, Lord. very fun. Be easy. Nah. Um, oh, good fun. luck. If you want any, actually, I'll talk to you about that after. Okay. <laughs> talk about editing during the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> what program do you use? I use, uh, well, I started Audacity, and I said, fuck that. Then I did Premiere, and then Zinn was like, hey, uh, you should use Audition. And then I did, and I was like, wow, this is just like Premiere, but it's actually meant to be editing audio. Who are your editing uh, inspirations? Um, You know, I really like to model <laughs> my work after um, the great and late Zinn Zinix. Uh, rest in soul, rest, soul rest in peace, Zinn. Amen, amen. He yeah. died during this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry if this um, also podcast is a, a little bit more like um, laid back and uh, maybe Sorry not exactly how you expect it. I don't know. Um, I I think we're all having a lot of fun. Don't get me wrong, but this is the first time I ever did anything with Blue Boy and also Globals, um, and uh, <clears throat> so it's definitely been an experience. I usually do NGPR, so yeah, this is yeah, this is a lot of fun. So, you know, yeah. you know how we'll wrap this up audience we're gonna, we're gonna pull the audience well let's ask that's anyone a good idea. have any we'll, we'll pull up three people and we'll invite them in so anyone have any particular questions for ike they'd like like to tell the big man himself uh, i'm looking down on you i'm, I'm on my big we, we are in very high chairs right now we're in fucking thrones right now <laughs> i'm just like uh, abraham lincoln statue check me out Oh, we got someone typing a lot right now. Thank you. Oh, Brandy's got a question. Yeah. Sorry for being too chill and too awesome. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I just read what Josh said. All right, Brandy's banned. Okay, so we're not going to listen to Brandy. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to delete that message. Uh, You're going to have to edit out also a lot of pauses no, we'll keep and them. silences. I, I liked what uh, Ninja Muffin <laughs> was saying, which I should make them longer. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. So Josh wants me to stop this very soon. So I'm just gonna quickly go through. Uh, let's see. Everyone have you have 10 seconds to type. You I want to ask a question. You have 10 seconds. All right. Starting now. 10, 9, 8. Oh, oh. Boner Boner Boy has a question. <laughs> Boner Boy 824 has a question. All right. What's your question, Boner Boy? Do you like soup, Ike? What kind of soup? This is very important. Any. Soup is good. I like soup. If if it's wait if it's specific to the type what then what's your preferred type of soup? Yeah, this is gold. Uh uh uh, is chowder soup. Chowder soup. You heard it here. Brock. All right. Um. Okay. So and then when we scroll up, so what are you doing there? You so you already answered that one. All right. Um. <clears throat> we hear more of that cat earlier. Is your cat around? Uh, no, he fucked off. All right, okay. He's not around. It's big sad. All right, oh, all right. Ravi, you're going to be the last person, and then, I, then I'm going to wrap this up. Gaspacho. No, Brandy's Brandy. banned from asking questions. <clears throat> Brandy just wants to talk about shirt. Favorite drink? What's your favorite drink? Uh, water or Baja Blast. Thank you. Excellent. <laughs> I like the dichotomy between those two. Yeah, the the good and the bad, the angel yeah. and the devil. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, th thanks for coming on, Ike. Is been... Those are fucked up questions. Is there no real question? Hold on. <laughs> that last 10 minutes needs to be edited out. Yeah, I'm going to edit a lot of that out. That, uh, <laughs> the oh, these are good questions. Right? Right? No, these are great questions. <laughs> <laughs> For the show, is... I, I'm not gonna tolerate that. It'd be like, all right, well, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, awful Ike host next year's summer jams, a la Highlander and Kill Me. What are you saying? 
tune in for for Brandy's beheading on uh, nine eight seven. Brandy, come and join the question and voice. How about that? Is, is, can you <laughs> oh, do that? Please. Oh my god! Golly! Are you okay gonna, with that? Oh my golly! We're gonna extend this by like an hour. What do you use to animate? Use this tune boom, Jade. Jade's Jade five Maya. feet away After from me. <laughs> Sony Vegas. Brandy. Sony Vegas. <laughs> Zen's not gonna hurt Sharp. you. He's fine. I'll. Take, I'll take his beatings for you. Oh, well, here's a good one. Flare with the real questions here. Are you? Thank do you, you ever plan on doing any three sculpts? Uh, I'd like to. Uh, I'm probably going to once I learn Blender. Blender is a scary beast that I am I'm, uh, hesitant to tackle. Are you? It's not. It's actually awesome. Wait, have you ever used Blender? Blender's super easy. <laughs> Speaking from someone <laughs> who only had my experience, I learned Blender in a week. It's it's super <laughs> easy to pick up. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, every every single person probably like or at least half the server will go crazy about helping you with Blender. Yeah, are you Blender part of the 3DNG server? server? You should also let me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just gonna say 3DNG. This is ran by Brandy uh, and uh, I think uh, I guess Kai. Sure. Um, check check, man. I'm already in there. But oh, cool. Yeah, you're already in there. Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> they're super Kicking. helpful and um, they're on top of their own server, which is I'm not used to that ever. For people doing that, I keep getting invited. I have a fucking folder full of a bunch of new grounds, people servers, and they just they die because no one keeps up with them. But that one's really good, and I really want Brandon to reiterate whatever question he had, but he's just making conversation with Meryl. <clears throat> All right. Well, now Wait, we're really. Will you be able to? Will you be able to make music and post them? Up? He. Is this a question for him? Are you going to be able to make music and post them on Newgrounds? Are you going to be able to? Yes. Okay. Got him. <laughs> I'm just going to do this real quick. <laughs> Thanks, Brandy. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, my well, God. So, yeah. I, well, my, my question is, a la like Highlander, there can only be one. Like, awful like you and Stratomayor here. You both won first and second place of the summer jams. Do you think you would end up ever hosting a summer jams? Because when I Let's won third it. place, I ended up hosting it this year. Yeah, please do, because I want to compete, but I don't want to host. That would be cool. Let's That'd do cool it so enough. you don't have to do yeah. shit I'd next host. year. Except I don't have money to give. This game cool. now I do. Yeah, Zim raises well, yes. a good point. <laughs> we'll yeah, make yeah, a money, big money, petition. Money on the table. We'll talk to Tom. And... Uh, yeah, because like people love this shit. They love the summer jams, but it is a bitch to I host. think so too. Yeah. I think like coming yeah. off of winning, I just wanted to see it happen again, but I didn't want to yeah. participate in every round to try and win. I just wanted to like butter in a submission if I felt like it. So is that something that you guys would it's, be interested it's in? Definitely a lot of fun. I, I think I could. Maybe co-host. That's a smart way. I'm interested in you, Brandy. Are you? <laughs> That's so high pitched. I like that. Um, I like that Ike's boyfriend stole a bunch of pins from pilots. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, yeah. He he uh, he keeps the hats too. <laughs> Wait, what happened to the pilot? What happened to the pilot? The steward is the pilot. What happened to like bag and them. vacuum sealed to get the blood out? <clears throat> They're giblets. Yeah, Zen has a good point. Uh, what about our questions, Ike? Why don't you ask us some fucking questions, huh? I already did. It's not all about you. <laughs> it's um, not. Oh, it's not. Oh shit! I've been doing this wrong. Listen, I've, I've been a asking editing questions. I, I really care about the editing process. <laughs> All right. So actually, you want you want to know more about the editing, editing process? I edit it, and then Zin tells me it's not good enough, and then he redoes it after I've spent hours editing it. That's that's the editing process. I think Zin's just mad that like six years ago he applied to be the Sleepy Cast editor, and he got rejected in round one. Oh, that's some tea. It's okay, Zen. I got I got rejected too. <laughs> he, no, he just, the Kubrick of editing. He just hyped you up, and then now here you are dropping, spilling all this tea. Yeah. Oh. Um, I, I do want to say though. Um, oh, go ahead. Uh, I, I I think the the jam was a lot of fun. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It, it it motivated me to actually make things. I don't think I ever wanted to like. I don't I don't know. Like m making a project is very like daunting, like the whole undertaking of it, but. This showed me you can kind of like do it in just like a little, like a month, if that. 
Yeah. Yeah. yeah having a deadline oh, is fun. surprisingly a great motivator to get you get your ass working. No, it's great. I, I recommend it to anyone who like wants to get into it but just hasn't yet. Yeah. yeah. And I think Absolutely. that's awesome. Did you did you do the jam expecting to get anything out of it? And did you No. No, really, not at all. I, I didn't know if I would finish the first one. Yeah, at all. you got a free wow. trip to glorious Kansas City. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> hey, yes. Oh man, that's so cool. Right. I will tell you what. Um, the the whole reason that I'm selling the shirts is actually so we're raising money for Tom Thank to you, host Brandy. a jam. <laughs> no, so Tom is going to host an animation jam. I I think either end of the year or beginning of next year uh, using that money. Right. Yeah. Please yes. Okay. Oh, that's true. Yeah. So now, yeah, that's a reason. Don't worry, I'm being relevant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so i'm not getting any of the money that's going straight to tom to host okay. the jam and also ngp is an actual target for the kkk we hate the kkk tell everyone that uh, oh sorry yeah excuse me i was reading off um what was needed to be said I we think. are reading um but yeah um, uh brandy how, where can we find those shirts oh man you have to like type in a url Go for it. Newgrounds.com. Oh, boy, you're going to be doing some harsh editing. <laughs> I know. I'm, you know, I'm trying, you know I, I tried to wrap it up like 10 minutes ago, and then Shao so, opened his fucking mouth. <laughs> make me look good, man. Come on. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna, look good. I'm going to make you louder than the rest of Tom. us. Your voice the easy actually, address is store.myname.com, because I didn't want to buy an extra domain just for this. And who are you? What is your name? Oh, it's your in the chat. Yourself. It's store.brandondreesy, <laughs> D-R-I-E-S-S-E.com. This is going to be... Okay. That's store.brandon, D R I E S S E dot com. Ah! This is going to be recorded, so I'm re. Yeah, re that's fine. Re yeah. We'll link it in the chat, you know, in the description. Yeah. Right. All right. Okay. Now, um, all right. I'm, I'm, I'll put my foot down. Just I, as much as I would like to keep this going, I have to edit this. And then if I don't edit this, Josh has to edit it. And I don't want Josh to edit this. So. Sorry, you can edit it yeah. together. I do have one more question, actually. Nope, 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 nope. Sorry. Nope, nope. Where do you get your ideas? Nope, sorry. Questions. All right. All right. Okay, so, anyways, <laughs> thank you, Ike, for coming on. It's been really chill to talk to you. I'm glad no problem, to no yeah. put a voice to the face and get to yeah. know you. Thanks for fun. thanks for letting me help you out, Bull Boy uh, and NGP, um, and you did great. Ike, you're great. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Gobbles. Yeah, I'm just here. Hold on. <laughs> I'm, just, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just sitting. And then uh, thanks, Brandy, for showing up. <laughs> See everyone next time. Yeah. Thank you for listening to the New Grounds podcast. This show is recorded live on our Discord server. Join us at bit.ly slash NGP Discord. For the latest news, follow us on Twitter at the NG Podcast. Thank you to Waterflame for the use of his song, Gabberfly. Goodbye. It's time to shout out our patrons. Starting with our super patrons, we have ZJ, Stepford, Ravi, Pixel Turkey, Meryl, Gio Corelli, Cortat G. Charissa, Boozle, Benny, and Bacon. Next up is our fabulous grand super patrons. Teravax, Kevin Polo, Daniel McDonald, and Carter Sterling. And last, but certainly not least, it's the ultimate grand super patrons. Big thanks to Katuri X, Camlon. And Mr. Tom Falp! Oh, that was rough. Oh, mm. Mm. Why does it taste like... Is that blood? Yeah, that's blood. Oh, shit. Uh, I think I need to go to the doctor. <laughs>